All right, ladies, so here we go. This is another Outre unit, and this is their Botic Hair Bundles, and she's called Brazilian and a color number four. So, of course, she does look more or less like a color number two, but as you know, each company's version of hair color is totally different. So this one has a U or an L-shaped part, and I did go ahead and squeeze some of the hairs out. It does have some combs in the front, and if you've seen by my facial expression, I really wasn't too pleased with the placement of the combs in this unit. So let's go ahead and put her on and I'm going to just line her up onto my head and I will place the combs in after I've situated her to where I want this unit to be. I'm going to go ahead and take my rat tail comb. I'm just going to pull a little bit of hair out in the frontal area which is my own natural hair. This is going to help give the illusion of a more natural appearance with our lace front. We never want our lace fronts to look boxy. And it's really not a good idea to place the actual lace front right on your hairline. So you want to make sure you pull it back a little bit and just pull out a little bit of your own hair. So that way you have a natural hairline. I'm going to go ahead and use a bobby pin in the back area because the cap was just a little bit too big. And placing a bobby pin between the net and my hair will help hold the cap down. I'm going to be using my Topic Keratin hair, fill, hair Building Fibers. This is really great for anyone with thin edges, balding spots, or just losing hair. This fiber will build up and it does give an illusion of a more thicker hair. Now to make my scalp edge on my actual wig look more realistic, I'm going to go ahead and use my e.l.f. Coverall Concealer Stick. This is in the color medium. I've already went ahead and placed some concealer onto the actual lace, which was a lighter color, and that's just to brighten up the lace. But now this time around, I'm going to go ahead and place some of my e.l.f. on top of that, along with a portion of my own natural scalp that is out, and blend that in together. That way, you don't see where the wig stops and where my hairline starts. I'm going to just brush some of these curls out because it's a little bit too curly for me. I like a little bit more relaxed curl in my hair. There are a lot of layers in this unit which makes it really full. And like I said, Outre is really stepping it up. Now this unit is available at sisterwigs.com so you can check them out. I'll post a direct link to Brazilian below. As well as that is make sure to check out their makeup website which is sister21.com where you can purchase loads and loads of inexpensive makeup from NYX, LA Girl, LA Colors, Clean Colors, and a whole bunch more. As you've seen, I did use some hairspray, which I will use in just about any type of hair texture, from synthetic to human, hairspray always works. Do you see that part? OMG, pop in, yes, pop in. Now just to lay a little bit more of my building fibers, and that's about it. So yeah, let's go on, move on, and see what this baby looks like. So yes, ladies, here we go. Brazilian by Outre. This is their Bat Tick Bundle Hair Wig Collection. And the color that I have in Brazilian, because that is the name, is the color number four. So to me, she looks more or less like a color number two. And she was a really super easy wig. The one thing that I had to do with her is I had to tweeze a little bit. I like to tweeze the synthetic ones because the synthetic wigs are just a whole lot easier to tweeze. The hair just comes out of the lace super easy. It is the harder lace, but for the most part, she's really cute. I do like the curls a little less curly, but I do like the layering in it. Very pretty layering, and it is an L-shaped curved part. So the one thing I thought about the wig is I really did think it was a less, a little bit less um, silky texture. But this one is really cute. So as for being called Brazilian, um, it's not what it's supposed to resemble as it's just her name, but she is layered really well. So there's short layers and it just gradually goes into more layers. And I think the older she gets, the more the curls will fall more naturally. So of course she did shed, no big deal. She's synthetic, so I'm not really worried about that. But there are other color uh, color options available on sisterwigs.com for this one right here. So as for Outre, I have been doing quite a few of Outre units. And for the most part, they are really stylish. I do like that they have more density. Back then, 
I was not like a huge fan of Outre because they were kind of on the thin side. But as for the cap, the cap fit a little loose and it's probably because I had to pull back. So normally if I feel like it's a little loose right here, I'll just take a bobby pin and just put it between the net of the actual wig and my own hair or my net if I have one. And that way it'll stay down and it's not so loose. And you see, I already did put concealer on the actual lace, but the first concealer that I use is more or less like a light concealer. It's a little bit lighter, but it's just to help the lace like brighten up. And then I'll go ahead and use the concealer that, you know, I normally will use that will match my scalp. But other than that, this is like a gorgeous unit. It's really affordable as well as that is Altre is stepping it up. So, of course, she's going to tangle because she is synthetic. But as long as you just make sure you take care of her, you can always um, trim the nape area. If it gets too tangled, over time they will get a little ratty, especially the nape area. So, what I used to do is I would trim it away so that way it wouldn't take away from the actual wig itself. But Brazilian, she is super cute. Really cute and easy. And I, like I said, I like the way the part is. You can put your hair like a little curve and it'll look so realistic, y'all. So, yes. Color number four. She's available at sisterwigs.com. Make sure you check it out. And I'll post all the information for you girls below. And on that note, make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs this video up and share. And I'll see you girls in my next video.